Hey guys, I'm Dwayne Soap here. Welcome back to the channel. And Apple has released today a new beta, iOS 14.5, developer beta 3. Now, today's update came in a little later than it usual. It usually comes around 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. This one was released around 4 o'clock. A little later, as I mentioned on one of my tweets, it would be released today. And here it is, 14.5 beta 3, approximately 500 megabytes, give or take, depending on which device you're updating and the software that you're updating from now there's one major change with this software of course we'll be covering everything in this video if you want the entire coverage of everything that's new with the software so far my entire beta coverage will be linked in the description you can check that out right now so let's head on over here to general and then about and check out the latest build number there it is 18 e 5164 H. Now, there's still a few betas in the pipeline. I'm thinking maybe two more betas or one more beta and a release candidate before the official release. So pretty much two more betas and then an official release. This software will most likely be released to everyone worldwide towards the end of March. Now, there's a big change here. Apple has gone ahead and released a new items tab for the find my application. So if we go to the find my application, we now have the new items. Now this was leaked before, and this is hinting at Apple's new product air tags that we've been talking about here for months now. And it looks like Apple has now added the ability to have air tags active in beta three for iOS 14.5. However, if you click learn more to bring you to Apple's website, but nothing's really happening there. And if we click add an item, I try adding other Apple items, but nothing happens here like headphones and things like that this will give you the ability to tag your items things like luggage maybe a backpack a bike and you can actually tag those and find them in a map using the find my application as you can see here this is the brand new splash screen that you see on the latest beta here you see supported accessories you can add non-apple products to find my locate your backpack your luggage your headphones maybe third-party headphones and even other items this is a splash screen once you update to the latest beta Beta. Now, as you can see here, this one is running the previous beta. There is no items tab here. So in comparison to now, we now have a new items tab there. And it looks like Apple just doesn't really care anymore. They know that everybody knows AirTags is coming. So might as well just add it. We're expecting Apple to have a new announcement for this product here shortly before the release of the software or right alongside iOS 14.5. So as of right now, as I mentioned, developers have access to 14.5 beta Three. Now, public beta testers, you can follow me on Twitter. I'll let you guys know when this is available, but that is the biggest change so far in the latest beta, the supported accessories in the Find My and the Items tab for the Find My application. Now, of course, stay tuned for my follow-up video because I'll be sharing with you guys additional new features and changes as I dig around the software a little deeper to see what else is new with this software. I've only had it installed for about two hours now after digging around the software. That's pretty much the biggest change so far. I'll be talking about the battery and any additional new features in my follow-up here in the next couple of days. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.